Here's a summary of Meniere disease. The pathophysiology is increased volume and or pressure of endolymph, also called endolymphatic hydrops. You can see a picture of this structure here containing the endolymph in the background. The signs and symptoms, patients will have discrete episode lasting 20 minutes to 24 hours, and these will be recurrent episodes. They'll have vertigo, which is a sensation of movement and spinning. They can have hearing loss, unilateral, low frequency, sensory neural hearing loss, tinnitus, and or oral fullness as well. The workup and diagnosis consists of doing a comprehensive audiogram and then an MRI to rule out other central causes of vertigo. To treat this, first do lifestyle and diet modifications. So you want to decrease dietary salt, decrease caffeine and alcohol, and decrease any allergens or allergy triggers that they might have. There's maintenance pharmacotherapy that you can start, like hydrochlorothiazide and beta histine. You can also give pharmacology for acute episodes, like vestibular suppressants and antiemetics.